Welcome to Trendsetters. Join us as we explore the future of Maya trends. Mars has long captivated human imagination. From ancient mythologies to modern science fiction, its proximity and striking similarities to Earth make it a prime candidate for exploration and potential colonization. But can we transform this cold, arid planet into a second Earth, a process known as terraforming? Advancements in technology and science have brought us closer to this possibility, yet significant challenges remain. The concept of terraforming. Terraforming is the bold and futuristic idea of transforming a planet's hostile environment into one suitable for Earth-like life. This involves altering the atmosphere, climate, and surface conditions to make it habitable for humans, plants, and animals. For Mars, a planet characterized by thin air, freezing temperatures, and a barren landscape, terraforming would require a series of transformative steps. These include raising its average temperature, creating a thicker atmosphere by introducing greenhouse gases, and generating water resources either by melting polar ice caps or synthesizing water from hydrogen and oxygen. Additionally, creating oxygen-rich air to support breathing would be a monumental goal. The concept of terraforming isn't new. It has been discussed in science fiction for decades and has inspired real-world scientists to consider its feasibility. Thinkers like Carl Sagan were among the first to speculate on the idea of terraforming Mars in the 1970s. Today, the concept has evolved into serious proposals grounded in advancements in climate modeling, nanotechnology, and synthetic biology. While the idea may seem like science fiction, it serves as a framework for addressing how humanity could adapt to and transform extraterrestrial environments for long-term survival and exploration. Why Mars? Mars is an ideal candidate for terraforming due to several compelling factors. Its proximity makes it the most accessible planet for exploration and potential colonization compared to other celestial bodies. Additionally, its day length, at approximately 24.6 hours, closely mirrors Earth's, aligning well with human circadian rhythms and reducing the physiological challenges of adaptation. Furthermore, Mars possesses polar ice caps rich in water and carbon dioxide, offering essential resources for creating a thicker atmosphere and sustaining life. These unique attributes make Mars a realistic target for terraforming efforts, despite the immense scientific and logistical challenges involved. Current technological endeavors. In recent years, remarkable advancements have been made in Mars exploration, led by key programs like SpaceX's Starship and NASA's Perseverance rover. SpaceX, under Elon Musk's vision, has been developing the Starship spacecraft for Mars missions, with Musk announcing in September 2024 plans to launch five uncrewed starships to Mars within the next two years to test landing technologies and gather critical data for future crewed expeditions. Meanwhile, NASA's Perseverance rover, which landed in the Jezero crater in February 2021, continues its mission to uncover the planet's secrets. It has traveled over 30 kilometers, collected 24 samples, and delivered invaluable insights into Mars' geology and potential for ancient life, all contributing to our understanding of the Red Planet and paving the way for human exploration. Proposed Terraforming Methods Several innovative methods have been proposed to terraform Mars, each addressing the need to create a warmer, more habitable environment. One approach involves introducing greenhouse gases to trap heat, though a study from the University of Chicago highlights a novel alternative, releasing metal nanorods into the atmosphere, which could efficiently increase surface temperatures by up to 30 K. Another proposal suggests deploying massive space mirrors to reflect sunlight onto the Martian surface, which would melt polar ice caps and release CO2 to thicken the atmosphere, though this idea faces formidable engineering hurdles. A more radical concept involves redirecting asteroids to collide with Mars, using the energy released from the impacts to generate heat and atmospheric gases. While these methods are theoretically promising, each presents significant challenges, including technical feasibility, safety risks, and potential unintended consequences, underscoring the immense complexity of terraforming Mars. Biological Approaches 
Introducing resilient organisms to Mars presents a promising avenue for aiding terraforming efforts by kickstarting ecological processes. Researchers discovered that the Antarctic desert moss Centrichia caninervis can survive Mars-like conditions, making it a potential candidate for producing oxygen and initiating soil formation on the planet. Additionally, advancements in genetic engineering have focused on developing microbes capable of thriving in the harsh Martian environment. These specially designed microorganisms, such as modified cyanobacteria, could be employed to convert carbon dioxide into oxygen and contribute essential elements for sustaining life. While both approaches remain in experimental stages, they highlight innovative strategies for creating a foundation for more complex ecosystems on Mars in the future. Challenges and considerations. Terraforming Mars is an ambitious goal, but comes with significant challenges that require careful consideration. The immense time frame, spanning centuries or even millennia, means the benefits of such efforts would be realized far into the future, demanding sustained commitment across generations. Ethical concerns also arise, particularly regarding the potential discovery of native microbial life and whether humanity has the right to alter a pristine extraterrestrial environment. Additionally, the resource requirements for terraforming would be colossal, involving vast amounts of material, energy, and financial investment potentially diverting attention and resources from pressing issues on Earth, such as climate change, poverty, and sustainability. These challenges underscore the need for a balanced approach, ensuring that exploration and potential colonization are pursued responsibly, with a clear understanding of the ethical, environmental, and societal implications. The role of policy and international collaboration Global cooperation is critical for the ethical and successful colonization of Mars, as no single nation can tackle the immense challenges of terraforming alone. Spacefaring nations are revisiting space policies to address the legal and ethical implications of transforming Mars, particularly in light of existing international treaties like the Outer Space Treaty, which emphasizes the peaceful use of space and the prevention of harmful contamination. Collaborative efforts, including joint missions, shared research, and coordinated funding are vital for pooling expertise, resources, and technological capabilities. Establishing clear international agreements and partnerships will ensure that Mars exploration and potential colonization are guided by principles of sustainability, equity, and respect for both scientific discovery and the preservation of extraterrestrial environments. Public Perception and Cultural Impact The concept of terraforming Mars has deeply influenced popular culture and continues to shape public perception of space exploration. Science fiction works like Kim Stanley Robinson's Mars Trilogy delve into the scientific, political, and ethical intricacies of colonizing and transforming the Red Planet, inspiring readers to envision humanity's interplanetary future. Meanwhile, Recent developments, including SpaceX's ambitious plans and groundbreaking scientific studies, have attracted widespread media attention, fueling public interest and debate. These cultural narratives not only generate excitement, but also influence how societies perceive the feasibility, risks, and ethical dimensions of terraforming Mars. Public engagement through these stories and media coverage plays a vital role in sustaining interest fostering global dialogue, and driving momentum for Mars exploration initiatives. The Future of Terraforming Research The future of terraforming research is rooted in ongoing advancements in technology and the use of sophisticated simulations to evaluate the feasibility of transforming Mars into a habitable world. Innovations in material science, biotechnology, and aerospace engineering are critical for overcoming current limitations, such as creating heat-absorbing nanoparticles to warm the Martian atmosphere or developing synthetic organisms capable of producing oxygen and facilitating soil formation. Additionally, advanced computer simulations and models play a pivotal role in predicting the outcomes of various terraforming methods, such as asteroid impacts or greenhouse gas introduction, by providing insights into their potential effects on Mars climate and ecosystem. These tools help refine strategies and guide future experiments, 
ensuring that theoretical concepts are translated into practical applications while addressing the complex challenges of terraforming. Thanks for joining us on Trendsetters. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell so you won't miss any groundbreaking insights. Until next time, stay curious and keep exploring.